Hello my baby gorillas and I thought I would just update you on what has happened to the petition um, to have a public inquiry into Gordon Brown and Jackie Smith's involvement in the cover up of the Muslim child rape gangs and the exploitation, sexual exploitation of children. So I would think that this is very serious. So I would just like to read out your response. Obviously we've got the five signatories um, to have the thing actually advanced so that we could actually find out from the Petitions Commission whether or not we could actually set it up as a, pet a petition. So if anybody has got any ideas of how to actually hold Gordon Brown and potentially Jackie Smith, certainly Jackie Smith is alleged to have sent out the circular to have all these people stand down. So obviously Jackie Smith was heavily involved, but I don't think it could have happened without Gordon Brown's say-so. And that's something that we, or, or that's certainly the allegation. And I don't, I think that's something that uh, we would have to get to the bottom of. So we reject your pet petition, public inquiry, Gordon Brown, Jackie Smith allowed sexual exploitation of children. Now there was only a limited amount of space there to actually write what I wanted to actually write and that's the way I had to uh, express myself because there was a limited number of uh, characters that I was allowed to use, a bit like Twitter. I would have probably expressed it slightly differently. So obviously to the petitions, UK government and parliament. Dear David Ballantyne, sorry we can't accept your petition. Public inquiry, Gordon Brown, Jackie Smith allowed sexual exploitation of children. It included confidential, libelous, false or defamatory information or a reference to a case which is active in the UK courts. Now, I don't know anything about this case. If anybody can find out uh, a, a, a case that's in the courts, then I'd be more than actually interested. As far as I was concerned, this is an a public inquiry. So uh, th if somebody has committed the underlying crime or uh, it's libelous, or if it's not, then people should be cleared in the public inquiry. The allegation, it didn't come from me, the allegation came from the lead prosecutor for the uh, northwest of England. So, it included confidential, libelous, false or defamatory information. I don't know if any of this is correct, so I don't know if it was defamatory or false or... Uh, what the actual situation was if it, there, because there hasn't been uh, any public inquiry into this as far as I'm concerned we cannot publish petitions and make accusations of a crime I didn't make any accusations of a crime I said that there needs to be a public inquiry into the accountability and if there is anything underlying then out of the public inquiry, then there should be criminal uh, proceedings uh, or there, there should be a move towards criminal proceedings. The, uh, I didn't make any accusations there was crimes there. You might be interested to know there is already a public inquiry into uh, child sexual abuse. You can find out more here at IIC sa.org.uk that's www i for india i for india c for charlie s for sierra a for oscar.org dot uk forward slash having phoned them on friday i found out that, that these people are not investigating gordon brown and jackie smith's involvement in the case which it makes sense. That's why I was calling for a public inquiry, not for some group to probably cover it up anyway. So I, I don't know what the, the next stage would be to actually find out what the Jackie Smith and Gordon Brown's involvement on the covering up of the mass uh, Muslim rape gangs all over uh, England and now starting in Scotland as well. We reject a petition that don't meet uh, the petition standards. If you want to try again, click here to, uh, to start a petition. 
So I uh, would have to start again, but I'm not sure if there's any lawyers or any people who know the law or um, know how to hold uh, public figures accountable, um, then please leave it in the comments. This is just a quick update. So again, covered up. Uh, the political class get covered up and they're allowed to do what they want, apparently, with no uh, accountability. So I think that, that if there has been a, a crime committed, I mean, there's Alex Salmond uh, being held accountable. So I don't understand how Alex Salmond would be held accountable for his actions in office, yet Gordon Brown and Jackie Smith are not held accountable. Maybe ask uh, Alex Salmond next time I see him. My baby gorillas, I hope you found that interesting, illuminating. And I think we have to now find out what the situation was with Gordon Brown and Jackie Smith's involvement. Right to your MPs.